this, everybody. Okay, so I think you can kind of see what I may be talking about here soon. This guy's been been busy. So I bet you didn't have any idea you were going to do all of the things that you've done in scouting before you came into scouting, right? No? All right. So do you think that the things that you've done in Cub Scouts has prepared you to go to the next level into Boy Scouts? Yeah? I think so too. So when you began your, your journey, I bet you had no idea that you were going to do all of these things, but you did. All right, uh, how much time we got here? Uh, here I'm going to run through this quick. Bobcat badge, tiger badge, wolf badge, bear badge, weeblos badge. Today is Arrow of Light. Uh, outdoor activity award, shooting sports awards and pins. Listen to this, BB gun, archery, and slingshot. Slingshot. Wow. It said slingshot, what? buddy. I never did that. Well, then I don't. You know. <laughs> Give me that pin. What a mistake. <laughs> it said slingshot, so hey, that's fine. Make sure you do slingshot, okay? Because you're trustworthy. The scout is trustworthy. Okay. Nova Award, which is a science, technology, engineering, and math type of award. Then he went to the next level. Very, very few boys go to this next level. He earned his Cub Scout Supernova and his Weeblos Supernova. I think the percentage of boys that get both Supernova in the Cub level is probably down around 1% or 2% of all of scouting everywhere. Of I course, have something to say. Go ahead, Joe. <laughs> this is all because my mom is a den leader. <laughs> I don't think it has to do with her being the den leader. Yes, it is. Yes, it does. Okay. So, in, in defense, as I'm a leader myself, the reality is, sir, you are not able to drive a car, right? Nope. Mom is going to take you from house <laughs> to scouts, okay? So, mom might have said, hey, you should go after your supernova. So, just like she's the driver of the car, okay, she's helping you get to where you need to go, right? And dad. All right. Back to the awards. Back to the awards. Leave No Trace Award, Outdoor Ethics Awareness Award, Outdoor Ethics Action Award, which is that one right there, a little uh, name tag one. World Conservation Award, Emergency Preparedness. Uh, listen to this. So Joseph didn't just do scouting during the school year. Joseph was also uh, busy during, the, uh, during the, the summer as well. He has his National Summertime Pack Award. You got all of them on there? So each different color represents tiger, wolf, bear, and weeblos. More like wolf, tiger, bear, weeblos. Well, you got them out of order, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um, you might wonder too. He wasn't a. There wasn't a lion program back when he started. So I'm sure if he if there was a lion program, he probably would have done that too. Yeah. Cyber chip, whittling chip, messengers of peace. Uh, this is interesting. So back in the day when there were belt loops, again, uh, they were sports and academic. There was 25 of each. Joseph, or Jojo, as I think I'm one of the only people that call him that, Jojo has all 50 of the Cub Scout belt loops. These were, yes, you do. I thought I only got like 47 of them. Oh, you, you got 50, sir. And let me give you an example of a couple of these that I thought were pretty notable. Astronomy, uh, disabilities awareness. Those are a couple that you worked on. Um, he also is a, what's called a Weeblo Super, uh, got the Weeblo Super Achiever Award, which is where he completed all of the Weeblos and Arrow of Light adventures. So, meaning when he was in the top levels of Cub Scouting, he got every single one of the adventure pins. So, sir, I hope that this compass serves you well, and it's been an honor. I'm sure I'll see you around in the troop in the future. So, a round of applause for Joseph.